Look at that. We made it to Yellowstone Lake. What do you think about that? So. You're fine. Yellowstone Lake. We actually might have to leave the campground because there's no internet here and daddy has to work. So we're gonna see if we can figure out another solution. If not, Daniel, right here. I'm dropping down. Oh. <laughs> Woo. Okay, we might have to, um, so we're gonna try to figure out a different solution if there's Wi-Fi at the lodge, maybe. If not, we might actually have to leave. Well, people are swimming in it, Daniel, so, and kayak. So I think you're okay. Touch the water, see if it's warm, because this, this used to be an, a volcano. And inside the lake, there's actually still hot springs um, that bring hot water into the lake. A little bit cooling, a bit. nice. Yeah? Pleasant? Mom, it's here. Mom, people get a hint of cool and a hint of hot. I see. <laughs> All right. Daniel is ready to film Yellowstone Lake under the water. Daniel! Who do you think is gonna go in there first? Me. <laughs> not today, Daniel, not today. Okay, buddy. Oh, this is cool. Well, let me call Daddy and see if he has figured out his internet situation. Okay, we just got the word. Daddy got internet. <laughs> I guess the Grand Village Campground is right next to the Grand Village Lodge. And I'm not really sure. There's like a restaurant, gas station, um, store. So it's like a little Grand Village. So we will be here until tomorrow morning. And then it's off to the next RV park. They're going to go over there. Not sure why. I think I'm just gonna go through the water here. Oh, oh. I wouldn't say it's warm, but it isn't freezing. Come on, Jesse, you can do it. It's not that deep. Oh, we made it. Yay! <laughs> Yeah. What is it? It must be mud. What else would it be? It's mud. Mom, am I in sand or something? Oh, wow, you're sinking in there. It's like, uh, what is it called? That sand. Soul sand. Oh, is that what it's called? Soul sand? Okay, well, it's not as bad as over there, Mom. Yeah. You're like sinking in. I know I saw Daniel sinking like past his ankles. It is so shallow. Yeah, I'm going in. I'm running in. This side is probably better. Not so muddy? Rock and hard. <laughs> See? Uh oh. Well, I would suggest wearing your water shoes for rocky or muddy ground. Going to the warmer side. <laughs> it's <laughs> it's definitely beautiful. It's just a really hazy day. This would be nice on a clear sunny day. Can't always get lucky. Okay. We almost made it all the way around, made it over here. Now we're gonna go and see if we can make it back to Christian Spike over there. Jesse is in Yellowstone Lake! Yay, Jesse! Yeah, that's enough for her. <laughs>
Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we have to make it past this little forest here to get back over the bridge and then back over there where the campground is. Without any bear we didn't bring bear spray. And Jesse's freaking out. <laughs> Jesse is acting really weird. Daniel. <laughs> Daniel, on the other hand, is going to be the meat. Yeah, stay close to me, Daniel. Okay. Okay, let's just keep going. I think once we make it over the bridge there and through that little forest part, through the forest, we are, we are hopefully okay. There's a lot of bears here. And then somebody finds the video and it's still rolling. Oh God. <laughs> Come on, Daniel. Don't run, Christian. They might feel like chasing you, you know? It's better to stay together in a group and make lots of noise. Daniel, together. You don't want to run. Mom, I've trained all my life for this. Look at me. I'm buff. Uh huh. You're going to fight a grizzly? Do a I mean, there are trails in here. I think if you have a look, oh, you can bike back there, Christian. I think if you have a no bike. Oh, no bike. <laughs> I think if you have a bear spray, you're fine. We just didn't think about that. Okay, we just have to make it through that little forest area there. This is the scariest part. Okay, there's the campground. Yeah, the campground is closed. If you didn't have to pick up your bike at the beach, we would be going up here. I can see a car up there. Okay, I think we're fine. Why are you smell? Why are you pulling me this way, Jesse? She's definitely smelling something. Are you smelling the RV? Is that where you want to bring us back to the RV? She's definitely pulling me this way. Come on, Jess. She doesn't want to. She doesn't want to go with me. No, I think she smells the way back to the RV. Hang on, Jessie. I'm not sure why Jessie is so afraid of the lake, but she does not want to go back that way. <laughs> Come on, Christian. Jessie is... Not moving that way. She wants to go back. I'm kind of just hoping she can smell the RV and that's why she's pulling this way. All right, come on. Yeah, see, she's definitely going this way. Running, in fact. And there's the RV. Jesse, you are such a good dog. You are such a smart little cookie. She got us straight back to the RV. Look at that. Awesome. I'm gonna do the campground review tomorrow, but you guys got already a little bit of this. Thank you so much for tuning in. We made it back safe and sound. And hopefully you turn in tomorrow for the next video. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye. Coastside Family Adventures.